tabs in all of my projects, I've been using either a hacksaw or the scroll saw or even a Dremel sometimes. But when these lines and these cuts are very thin, it's pretty easy to mess up the part that you're cutting out. So I've been trying to figure out a better way to do this, and I've been looking into mini jigsaws, something with a very fine blade. So I tracked down a mini jigsaw. This is actually a gourd saw for cutting gourds. And we're going to open this up and take a look at it and see what we've got. This is our mini jigsaw. Ordered online. It came from the canning shop. So let's see how small this is. Hopefully this will help out with cutting all those tabs. This did come with a little case to hold all this stuff together. And it comes with the variable transformer tube. I've never cut gourds. I don't think I want to cut gourds, but for fine stuff, we'll see how this goes. And it's a little jigsaw. And this kit also came with some real fine, some real fine blades. So, very small. Should be perfect for these tabs. So, let's see what we've got. Power supply. This is our speed control. And then the actual jigsaw. And there's the saw. Those little tabs. That makes it really easy. Much easier than the hand saw or even feeding the scroll saw through. So I think that'll work out pretty well. got a nice light feel to it and because this area is so small it's very easy to look over the front and follow a really tight pattern so I think this can be used for a lot of different things in the shop but the tabs are primarily what I bought it for so it works out pretty well for parts when I'm in the middle of a project and I'm cutting out 20 or 30 little gears and little fins or little blades it gets pretty tiresome using a handsaw or trying to feed it all through the scroll saw. So something like this made sense for a lot of the projects I'm working on. A little bit expensive, this whole kit was about a hundred bucks. Um, came with the variable speed control, the power supply, and all that. So we'll see how it goes. Feels pretty good, and I think this will help. Thanks very much for taking a look.